Well, hello there. This is Matt Petrowski. I am a MailMate user and enthusiast. Been using it for years and I love it. It controls my email world. Now, this is a video that is the next in our series and we are taking a look at the topic of using MailMate counters. This is basically knowing what's in your mail before you actually check. Now, the biggest counter or the biggest reason that I use counters is this right up here. This is a menu bar indicator that tells me how many of particular types of emails that I have. And I have full control over four of these. Likewise, if you're a dock user, which I don't happen to be, over on the dock, we have a little icon that will actually show the same information on the four corners of the MailMate icon. So if you have a really large size dock and it's down at the bottom, you get those same indicators. I personally like the menu bar, but you can use both either or. So in MailMate, this is accessed within the preferences. So when you go to the settings and you go to the second tab of counters, you're going to see all of the options that you have. Now those include the four corners that you can choose. Now the way that they appear in the menu bar is based on their order. I don't know if it's left to right or clockwise. You can figure it out by basically turning them on, which we'll do right now. But we have the two display options, which are in the dock on the icon. That's what I'm not using, which is hidden over on the side or in the menu bar. We also have the option to show notifications. That's using the standard notification that actually comes up in the corner. The one that's right here that shows all of your do not disturbs and so forth or all of your different notifications when they pop up right here and you can choose what style it actually is within the system preferences. But if we go to a corner here and we choose in menu bar, you'll see that one item will be added and we choose our other option and choose that in menu bar, we get all four options. Now currently, I don't know if we can control the color. We may be able to. One of the great things about MailMate is the developer, he provides controls for everything. And if it's not in the actual user interface within the settings or somewhere within the rest of how MailMate works, it's typically hidden within some type of setting that you can control if you're comfortable going into the terminal. And he has these things documented in his release notes and within the MailMate help. Remember, you can always access that using the help menu. But what you show within these counters, again, is completely up to you. You can see that we can choose what mailbox we want to use. It can come from a smart mailbox. It can come from a sub smart mailbox. The source can be whatever you want. The count can be all, unread, those that are flagged, unreplied, or recent. You get to control how many of whatever the count of items is that it shows. You also get to choose a custom sound each time that the inbound mail actually hits or matches one of these counters. And then finally, when it comes to the menu that you have options, the end menu bar option, you get to actually control what is displayed. You can see right here as we zoom in, using a special formatted way of saying, I want the subject, which happens to be just a dollar sign with the open uh, brackets there, or whichever they are, curly braces, you get to control how it actually reads. So when I select on this number three right here, and I can see Jade tweeted, I miss her already from Twitter, I can see it says subject from, and then the from name from whatever. You get to control what you want to show. But the great thing about these counters is that you can see that when I click on them, if I want to, if I know that this is junk, I can basically choose to move it to junk right here within the actual menu bar without actually having to have MailMate open. This is accessible to me no matter what. I can be directly in the finder. This can be hidden. You can see that I'm in Text Wrangler right now. I can right click or click on this and I can just choose to do any type of action that I want right to them. That includes basically selecting the message itself and having MailMate open right up to that message for me, which is a very nice deal in terms of being able to access your information.